Meet Carl Kangas, owner of Quality Signs and Design. 30 plus years of installing and producing vinyl graphics, and he's here to help you install a vinyl wall decal like the pros do. First thing I want to share with you are the tools of the trade. First of all, you will need a Stabilo pencil. You will need a squeegee or a credit card, some painter's tape, and finally, a tape measure. Go ahead and remove the artwork from the mailing tube, and inside you will find complete detailed instructions on how to install your wall vinyl. Let's get started. First of all, you're going to want to lay your decal flat on a table. Then take a blow dryer and warm up the graphic. This will remove any wrinkles that might have occurred because of shipping. Then you're going to turn over your graphic and squeegee the back. And now you're ready to install. Every graphic has a baseline and a center line. Before you install your decal, you want to make sure that your wall is clean and dry. Apply three pieces of painter tape to the top of your graphic and then put it up on the wall in the approximate location. Stand back and look. If it looks right, measure from the top down to the baseline and left to right to the center line. In this case, I'm off a little bit, so I'll make my appropriate adjustments by making a mark at the center of the wall. Reposition the graphic to the center mark that you just made. Now make a mark on the wall where you want the baseline to be. Now you can reposition your graphic so the baseline lines up with your marks on both sides and the center line lines up with the mark in the center. It's a good idea to double check. Check your measurements left and right to make sure that the baseline is lined up. Next, you're gonna create a hinge using your painter's tape, which allows the decal to hinge upward. You'll notice that there are three layers, the backing paper, the vinyl, and the transfer tape. Now you're gonna flip the graphic up and begin peeling the backing paper off at a 45 degree angle, laying it back 180 degrees. Carefully remove the backing paper all the way across. Get a friend to hold the top corner or you can take a piece of painter's tape to hold it up for you. Discard the backing paper and bring the graphic down. Then gently squeegee the graphic starting from the top and working your way down you want to go lightly at this point and make sure that the graphic is flat to the wall. If you press too hard at this point, you will create wrinkles in the vinyl. After the graphic is flat to the wall, remove the hinge tape, then apply pressure to the graphic up and down from the center outward to the edges. Now you can peel the transfer tape off, again at a 45 degree angle and laying it back at 180 degrees. Take your time. There's no need to rush. And as you're peeling it back, you're gonna be watching along the edge to see if any of the vinyl is lifting. And if it does, hold it down with your thumb. Pay attention as you pull it off. No need to rush. Discard the transfer tape. And then, using your thumb like an iron, go over the graphic. You can see that it's forming to the texture of the wall. You now have an inspirational, custom-designed, removable vinyl wall decal that adds to the decor of any room in your home. I'm Carl Kangas from Quality Signs and Design. Thank you for joining me and watching this how-to video for installing vinyl wall decals. If you have any questions or need additional information, you can find us at etsy.com slash shop slash quality signs. The link is in the description box below. Don't forget to click like and comment below and please subscribe to this channel. Thanks for listening.